Hey there folks, this is GreenyXI, welcoming you right back to Let's Play Final Fantasy X. This is episode 21, and what we're going to do today is take on the Thunder Plains, where every enemy has so much electrical <laughs> elements to them. A couple of new enemies, but yeah. You want to look out for the enemies to give the best items to steal from. Not that stealing from these sorts of enemies will make too much of a difference, but still want to look out for it. <laughs> oh, and actually hit, I'm surprised by that. Okay, so the last enemy left. I'm going to steal from it because I'm pretty sure it's got something good going for it. Anyway, this is the first area where there's a lot of optional stuff to do. The first major area. Whether you do it now or later. You can't do it all now either way, but, you know, you want to keep an eye out for it. I also said in the last episode how there was something I was going to say. There's something I was going to tell you, correct myself on something in the last episode, but I can't remember now. You called? Booyah. Oh well, whatever. <laughs> I'm sure I'll remember at some point. Anyway, mostly simple enemies here, but there are two enemies. One that you make yourself appear at some point, and one which appears anyway in the north area, though not where we are now. So We're in the south area, which is the easier area of the two, enemy-wise. Okay, here we go. A bit more strength, that could be good. Not that we'll be using her for attacking physically, but... And again, because we're going Oren's route, I am not going to be moving him at all until we get a level 2 gear sphere. Wait, I want to have a look just in case. I'm pretty sure we're on Golem. But... No, okay. Ooh, Lulu. Lulu, come here. <laughs> just noticed that then. Small HP for... Okay, I'm not sure if a lightning strike just happened. Okay, something that I was trying not to mention till this episode. If you go near the lightning, the lightning rods or the towers, then you won't be struck by lightning. But if you wander away, then lightning will happen. If you get hit by the lightning, then nothing really happens. It's just a matter of having the animation that slows you down, getting across kind of thing. But if you don't get hit by it 200 times in a row, you get the best reward, because there's different rewards at the agency in the middle of this place. Where if you get 200, you get something for the ultimate weapon for Lulu at the end of the game. Shit. And reflexes are a big thing of it. Especially when you're just distracted by so much else. Uh, who was there? I think it was Tidus just learnt an overdrive mode called Slayer. Which makes it so your overdrive goes up every time you kill an enemy. That's one of the most useless ones for me. It's not going to help in bosses or anything, you know. Some more HP again. Bloody hell. I know she needs it, but... Wow. He needs some more strength, does our Auron. Okay, Cactus Stones for another little side questy bit of this place. Shit, I didn't press in time. Not doing very well with armor. Okay, two new enemies. Each of them has a bit of a gimmick. You've seen something similar with the element, but they. Let's get rid of him first, actually. A lot of health, so you want to have water and stuff by now. If you didn't before. This guy, he does a lot of damage with Thunderer, the Thundara, but as well as that, he can also use Thundara on himself and it'll boost his magic attack as well. So you want to try and take him down pretty quick if you can. If you can. The enemies in this area have got quite a bit of health compared to what I've seen so far, but yeah, no. Hopefully we'll still do it. Here we go. Lava's magic increased. That's what I was talking about just now. Okay, Tidus. Last up. Done. No time Easy to enough waste. enemies, don't you, like I said. I'll show off the enemies that are tough as well. I think that's all of them for the easy enemies though. Couple of ability spheres there. Eh? I'm happy with that. Oh, Kamari. Okay, don't press X on these things. Instead you want to press square. Random, but once you get to the agency, you see why that is. It tells you in a book in the agency to press square on these stones. There are more than three stones around the Thunder Plains, but only three of them at the most will actually have any effect. You, there's no point pressing square on any more than that. 5,000 gil, nice. Another new enemy by you is like an arrowman, but you know, color change and all that. See if we can do it. Yeah, got it. The accuracy is getting so good now that you don't always need Whacker to actually kill off the flyers. 
Get off your shite. <laughs> that thunder was more powerful than the thunder from the other guy. Shocking. That was a shockingly bad pun too. <laughs> Yeah, Kamai's got good defences, if nothing else right now. Who haven't we used? I think we'll use Waka. Get rid of the flyer by here. Tidus, I don't know if we used or not. If we have, I do apologise. Better heal him up. Because we've got so much MP now, the enemies are getting tougher. You know, you've got more stats to deal with them. Common sense to say, really. Come on, get away. I didn't mean to choose you. You can steal some good Electro Marbles from these. Good for customising. And good for combining with the Overdrive as well. Lots of damage. And I'll do. Somebody should level up after that. Yeah. Couple of them. Okay, so like I was saying, if you want to get one of Lulu's ultimate weapon pieces, then you need to avoid 200 lightning bolts in a row, and that means you can go into the pause menu, you can, but you cannot leave the screen to another area of the Thunder Plains. You can't use a save point to sort of break it up or anything by saving. It's a very tough thing to focus on in terms of reflexes and stuff. I find it impossibly hard. I did it back on the PS2 version after a million years of trying. You know like when you're little and you've got so much motivation and so much more energy to do it. Okay, because we press square on the cactus stone, now we can see these guys and get Kamari out straight away because these guys can use thousand needles just like in so many other Final Fantasy games. What? Oh, you done learning this game. I got confused with the other Final Fantasy games. Shocking me. <laughs> okay, so they've got high defense and high high uh, evasion rate. So you have to be a bit lucky to kill them all. They can run away as well if you don't get them quick enough. So yeah, you wanna you wanna try and be quick. And overdrive is your best bet. I'm trying to get everyone out here. We go. Let's see what she can steal. It's bound to be somewhat good, isn't it? I can remember being disappointed every time. Chocolate fella. Well, that's okay. I can use haste on a character, you know. Right, who we got left? Orin and Yuna. We've already used Yuna. We? Okay, let's get Orin out. And I want to actually kill this one off because you do get some a good amount of AP off these guys. So let's use Dragon Fan. Some of the toughest enemies we've come across today. The trickiest ones, at least. There you go, down he goes. And as you go on, you can no come across two waste. or three of them, Let's depending go. on how many of the stones you have activated. So... <laughs> it can become tough if the three of them use Thousand Needles in one turn. You've got to be a bit lucky. Waka, what's he going to get? A bit more jolty. Okay. Finally, we are done with this little sideways. Two more magic defense. Yeah, okay. Let heal up a bit. And we can carry on. Yay. I know it's another cactus stone around here somewhere. Christ. I had to keep blinking just as the flash is coming. <laughs> no levels up that time. Blimey. <sighs> Good day. Hi there. Is it true? I heard that Maester Seymour and Lady Yuna are to be wed. It's such great news. I have to tell everyone. Where'd you hear that? From the Guado. They were all very excited. Huh. I'm afraid you heard a little wrong. Yuna's gonna turn him down. <gasps> oh, really? I see. That's unfortunate. Well, I'm sure that people would have rejoiced all over Spira. <sighs> <laughs> Evil Tidus. How could you? 
on the map I can see a little thingy by you and I'm pretty sure this is where the stone is. Oh yeah, I, I remembered what I was trying to tell you earlier. Uh, the mega potions can't just be used by Riku, they can be used by anyone. I was thinking of a different type of potion you get later on. Which is Riku only. Eep. Ooh, new ability. What's she got, what's she got? Reflex. Oh, higher evasion rate for everyone. If you use it in the battle. In the battle. Alright, but I don't think I'll ever use it. Kura, better than Kira, same sort of thing. Ecstatic to the Amnala. Shit. You can probably see why I find it so hard to get. <laughs> to get what I need from these lightning strikes, the 200 dodges. Okay, so now that we've done two of them, we'll get two of them in the same battle all the time. I don't know why it's necessary, but you can get a lot of AP if you do this this way. So maybe that's why people can people do it. I don't know really. I know later on you come back here for something to do with cactus, but I don't think it's anything to do with. Yeah, Titus learned to slice some dice, which is a second overdrive. That's it hits all done. enemies from what I remember, and a few times each. So. Because it was an overkill on the one character as well, they got tons of AP. Bloody tons of it. So you can move again. <laughs> Accuracy isn't something she'll really need. I don't know if it affects her steal rate or not. Now we need to backtrack with Tidus and try and get back around. So we have to waste another couple of levels. Get in there. He pressed X! You turd. I did press X. I see us over here before carrying on. There's a couple of levels up, but first off I want to check out Teeds' new overdrive to make sure. Yeah, all enemies. And he sort of runs around hitting different enemies and stuff like that. So. It's a Slayer that he learned earlier as well. Charges when character defeats an enemy. The useless one. The most useless one, I would say. Here we go, yeah. You. I'll do. Atmosphere grid. Here we go again. She's so underleveled. She should be catching up soon enough, though. We need some more power spheres as well as ability spheres now, though. Maybe I should be using extract power more often. Okay. Oh my god! It keeps happening every time I go off the menu, so I don't have time to re react. Okay, so we just got yellow bangle for Lulu. I don't know... Is there any point bothering when we're doing okay getting through the lightning enemies anyway? I don't think there is, because I'll just have to change the equipment later on anyway. So I'm not going to bother. If we had a level 4 key sphere, it would take... What's the point now? And you do get some good stats, but who cares about accuracy for Yuna? Evasion is good. Max MP is good. Luck is good. We don't get many fortune spheres to activate the luck. There's some good stuff there, okay. But we haven't got level 4 spheres yet anyway, so... And I'm not going to wait around for her to, to get some. Two more magic defense, so get out. We're nearly back to where we were with him now. Great stuff. And Kamari is still waiting to be able to do something. <laughs> By the way, the third and final cactus storm we're going to activate is going to be on the other side. The other side of the Thunder Plains. I just got off of a, cac off of a cacti. A cactoscope. Or Cactus Spy, sorry. Initiative, so you get the first turn. She'll get the first turn at the beginning of every battle. Amazing, but not for regular encounters the way against now when it doesn't matter. So I'll, I'll hold on to it. That's it. Four more strength. Yes, he's been needing that. Um, there we go. Ooh, what we get him? Luck. Boost the luck of the party, which I, I can see being good, but once again, why use that when you can use damaging moves? Or more useful moves. Okay, here we go. Cutscene. Whoa! Ah! Whoa! That was a close one. <laughs> Stop kidding around. Yes, ma'am. Hmm. <laughs> what's wrong? <laughs> You're giving me the creeps. Ah! 
Hey, whoa! I want to go home. I hate lightning. I hate thunder. Let's go rest over there, please. This storm never stops. Better to cross quickly. I know, but just for a little while. <laughs> well, what now? <sighs> Pretty please? Just a few minutes. I'm scared of lightning. Let's rest, please. Pretty please? I'm too young to die. You're mean, cruel. Your moms would be ashamed of you. Are you having fun doing this to me? Fine. We rest. She's worse than the storm. I'm a little tired. Do you have a room available? Ah, Lady Summoner. Yes, just over that way. Thank you. Uh, Yuna? It's not like her. Well, it's nothing really. I I just uh, um uh, uh, I I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have uh, come in. Uh, uh, hey, wasn't that that just uh, called Guado guy? Fear is his will. It says, take care of my son. Huh. His son? Seymour? Well, I know one way to take care of him. I'm sorry. Huh? What do you think you're up to? You know, you know was acting funny. Yeah, so, so. yeah. She'll tell us when she's ready, so hold your chocobos till then. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. Stopping, is it? Don't tell me you were hoping it would. Ah! Fine, stay here. All right, already. But you didn't have to say it like that, you know. You could be more comforting or something. You know, try to cheer me up. You just don't get me at all, do you? Hey, are you listening? <gasps> I'm not scared! I'm not scared, you hear? How bizarre. <laughs> this is why I love Riku in this area. So
so much going through. Hello. I'm pretty sure you meant to get an Albert thing by you, but maybe not. Maybe I was wrong. Some yellow shields and stuff, which is cheaper than it was in Guard of Slam. If you really wanted to, but now you're halfway your course anyway. This is a book that, well, it tells you how many... Well, it tells you how to do the cactus stones for one, like we've been doing. Also, by pressing X on the lightning... <laughs> on the lightning thing. Yeah. It'll, there'll be a book here that tells how many lightning strikes in a row you've avoided. I normally have five. Five is the least, and it's a treasure chest up by you then. But I haven't done it this time. I've been shit. So... <laughs> nice yellow shield for free. These are normally quite expensive. For t that's the one. I will put it on him for now. But I will change it again. So he won't be affected by lightning at all now. If we went on the right route, if you do go on the right route and come back that way or whatever, it'll just be a shortcut and you just skip the agency part. That's all that happens. Oop, this the other stone. Oh, yeah. Okay, here's the last character stone. It's not lit up though, so I'm not sure if it can actually count. No, it's got to be a lit up one. Loads of okay. leveling up there. So, oh, a bit more defense for Lulu is always nice. Where are you going? Down here, yeah. Got a bit confused for a sec then. <laughs> More MP for her as well, for healing. Is that it? Nope, we do. Bag it. Four more jolty. Good. Anything of a plus four is always good. As you know. Now the cactus storm is not lit up again. Just the new enemy of the north part, the only new enemy of the north part, so it's the last enemy you'll be seeing in a random encounter. It is the Iron Giant, you've seen him a million times in Final Fantasy games, they are tough as nails if you go for physical attacks, but... You're also resistant to magic a little bit too. But not enough. Ugh, that's a lot of damage. They are physical fighters, run through. You can petrify him if you want to. You can poison him. That's the best way to go about it, I would say. I'll try Dark Attack, but I think it's immune to it. Uh, I think I was immune. <laughs> Looks like I need piercing weapons too. Which... It's all good. Oh, come on, Alan. Get you know out. Heal up a little bit. I'm not sure who I've used and who I haven't used now. <laughs> I haven't been paying attention in this battle at all. Right. At the least I want to get Wack back out and get rid of the little shit on the end who's getting on my nose. And I think Riku is the last one, yeah? Maybe Kamari as well. That's good for the protector shell that Luna could in. Come on then, Lulu, you might as well finish things up here. We're pretty much done with the Thunder Plains now. There are one or two more things you can do if you want to come back later. The Lightning Strike thing, I'm not going to be doing now. I might have an attempt at it later. <laughs> I'm not sure yet. I might. Because it's torture to me. Absolute torture and tediousness. What tedium. That's a lot of AP. But I might give it a go, just like five times or something. In a bonus episode, so you won't have to sit through it if you don't like that kind of thing. What have we got here to use? Magic, magic, defense, and luck. Wow. Well, I'm not gonna bother yet. Maybe I'll use it later. Two more magic defense. Okay, is that it? Better heal up a bit after all that. So, they're tough enemies, they are. In the next day we aren't going to have any easier enemies either. Just make things worse. Okie doke. Nothing much going on in that battle and nothing much after it by the look of it. So... We'll carry on. <laughs> right, anyway. Kamaru's really building up those sphere levels now and he'll be finding some key spheres soon. Oh, that's what we go in. Is that it? Do we only... 
Oh, okay. Build up. Around by you is where you can fight Ixion, I'm pretty sure. Dark Ixion, if you're doing the dark event. Looks like Sleep Attack is good for the Iron Giants. I forgot. Finally, we can make some progress on you. <laughs> MP, but... Well, I'll do for now. More MP? She's not going to be using magic. It would be good to take Riku around a magic route. Because she hasn't got that much strength anyway. Like, a healer, probably better than... Than a black mage. But... I don't know, it's up to you. Okay, we got a glowy one. Everyone, wait. What's up? I have something to tell you. Here? We're almost out of here. Let's go. I have to say it now. Over there. Somehow, my bad feelings always come true. I've... decided to marry. I thought so. <gasps> but, but why? Why'd you change your mind? For Spira's future, and Yevon's unity. I thought it would be... The best thing to do. That's not good enough. Wait, is it? Is it because of Lord Jiskel? Hey, that's fear! Show me. I can't. I must speak to Maester Seymour first. I truly am sorry, but this is... It is a personal matter. You're kidding, huh? As you wish. I'm sorry. Just one thing. Uh, I won't quit my pilgrimage. Then it is fine. Wait a minute, Oren. You don't care? I mean, you're not gonna stop her? No, I'm not. As long as she is willing to face sin, all else is her concern. That is a summoner's privilege, as long as she journeys. But that's... Uh, uh. Yuna, just one question. Can't you just talk to Maester Seymour? You got to marry him? Don't know. But I think it is the right thing to do. Okay, I guess. Uni. Quiet! I wish we could help somehow. Some way. It's okay. I'll be fine. She says I'm sorry. He says it's fine. She's willing to face sin. She's privileged. I didn't understand. But somehow, I felt like I didn't belong. But if I didn't belong with them, I'd be stuck in Spira, alone. And being alone in that place, well, I didn't want to think about it. Next, we're going to Makalania Temple. Yuna can talk with Seymour there. We Guardians will wait until they're done, and plan our next move. Understood. Leader of the Guardians. <laughs> Let's grab this. Yeah, that, and that glowy cactus stone. Trying to say before it was ever so rudely interrupted. <laughs> uh, glowy cactus stone is where we're going to next. Bloody hell, everything's coming against us to try and get that, innit? Ooh, there's another one by you. This'll do. Two cactus blocking the way to the cactus stone. 
and at the end of that battle we got a weapon for Wacker, which I'm pretty sure will give initiative so he has the first go for death and that return. If there are two characters with initiative, it will be the fastest character out of the two, I'm pretty sure. Initiative. Oh, it's not glowing anymore now. See, the bloody enemies get in the way. Okay, there's another stone over here. Another iron giant there, giving us a ton of AP. What's he got? Ooh, agility! That'd be nice for him, actually. Cover his weaknesses and all that. Evasion? Same sort of thing for her, really. Oops. Sorry about Kamari being so far behind, by the way. We just... He's not a character that you have to use in every battle. Especially in the battle that's coming. The boss that's coming, I mean. So... I mean, the boss is quite a ways off, but... Uh, you. That'll do. Come on, where's the other cactus? It's not blown either. Never mind. I, I, it doesn't matter anyway, does it? You don't get anything out of it. Fuck it. I just had to bugger off for a bit then during that battle. So I'm back now. Let's see what he is learning. Dark Buster. Okay, so that's like Dark Attack, but it's certain to affect the enemy if they, you know, if they can be afflicted by it. I want to show you for death Nut. I think it's one turn instead of three though, so you have to keep it up kind of thing. I think. Yeah, only for one turn. Almost always. So it's not certain still, but more chance. And, you know, it's it's good if you just can use Wacker. If, if you just can use Wacker for the one turn, just enough to get through a random encounter maybe. Yeah, we're done with the Thunder Plains for now. We'll be back later. For two seconds. about Yuna. <sighs> of course I'm worried about her. What is she thinking? The simplest answer would be, in exchange for agreeing to marry him, she hopes to negotiate with Seymour. Negotiate what? I wonder. What? All by herself? <laughs> She's strong. But Seymour is the better negotiator. Well then, why don't we do something about it? Yuna wants it this way. Huh. I just don't get it. Doesn't she trust us? On the contrary. She doesn't want us caught up in whatever it is she's planning. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. But that makes me worry even more. She could just tell us. That's the way she is. She's naive, serious to a fault, and doesn't ask for help. <laughs> You're probably right. Yuna's easy to read. <laughs> yeah, she is. But hard to guard. Stand by her. Always. Sorry. It's funny how calm I was. Maybe it was because I'd realized that Yuna wasn't marrying Seymour for love. Not really. It was just her duty. Something she had to do before returning to her pilgrimage. That's what I kept telling myself anyway. And well, maybe. I realized that Yuna and I'd never, you know. Yuna, let's go.
Okay, one dungeon done, on to the second in a row. <laughs> I don't know if I mentioned about the Thunder Plains, how I love the music so much. And there's this, there's this remix that comes with the CD that came with the collector's edition of Final Fantasy Theatre Rhythm, Coding Course for 3DS, where the Thunder Plains sounds so good in that too. Sounds even better, if that's even possible. But anyway, Macalania Woods is a much more calming place, magical place. It's got crystallised feel to it. I swear, it's what I think. Um, yeah. Wait, no, I went over like the other one. I got a reason for that. <laughs> it's got a crystallised feel to it, like crystal woods. Sort of like the crystal world in Final Fantasy IX. That wasn't the name for it, but crystal. Oh my god. Whatever it was called after Memoria. But yeah. This has been Green XI. I hope you've enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again next time when we go for all of the Macalania Woods and we do a couple of mini games because there's a couple of little side quests here. This is another area with a lot of optional stuff to do later in the game, but there's still one or two things to do now if we want to. We'll be introduced to another sort of side quest as well that runs throughout the game, sort of like the Albert Primers. And I'm pretty sure we missed an Albert Primer in the Thunder Plains Agency, but we've missed another one. Maybe you can go back and get it? I'm not sure. But you have a chance to get them all later on anyway if you've missed any so far. You can either go back by teleporting around the world, which we can't do yet, but we will be able to. Or you can go to a new area that can only you can only explore once. You'll see. Anyway, I'm babbling on. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again in a bit, folks. Wait, I wanted to mention something. Sorry. <laughs> I was just going to be where I ended it. I wanted to mention something. Because this is a long Let's Play, it's a Final Fantasy game for God's sake, there will be a mini-series coming out. I say this, is going to be a continuation of an old series that hasn't been continued on for ages. If you remember a while ago, actually I don't know when this will be coming out, I might have already started on the channel, but if you remember a while ago, Steam released, released a game, which I Let's Played, but couldn't carry on because Steam hadn't released the second part of it out of like a million parts. Well, the second part is coming to Steam soon. And once that comes out, I'll be starting that as well as Final Fantasy X. But that's a really easy game to record and render and everything. So it shouldn't get in the way too much. It should be two Let's Plays on the go at once. So it'll probably be every other day will be each one. There'll be Final Fantasy X one day and then the other series I'm returning to. Then Final Fantasy X, you know, it'll be in the same playlist as it was in before and that's that's about all I can say really and I think it'll be fun because I'm a big fan of our series so thank you so much for watching again <laughs> see you in a bit